I can't start the video because someone's calling my house. Stop. It's a scammer. Hi everyone. Today I'm going to go look at the new Tinkers that just came out. <clears throat> my favorite Tinker out of all of the spoilers I saw was the super, super light dapple gray one. And I think that one's coming out in the app. That's what everyone I've talked to has told me. Oh my gosh, this is one of the new ones. I read the news earlier and I can't even remember where they were. Pumpkin's here because he loves Tinker Horses. He just loves them. I love Tinker Horses and I'm happy more came out, but the light dapple gray one, I don't know. I don't know why it takes so long for the horses to get in the horses app. I mean, whatever it's called, the foals app. Someone said it took six months for the buckskin chinko teague to get into the foals app. So I am very concerned that the light dapple gray will not get in the foals app soon. This is the buckskin. I think this is my least favorite out of all the tinkers and it's just because I'm not a buckskin person. You know, it's great if you're a buckskin person. I think one of my cats is destroying something. That's what I'm hearing. You know, this just looks like spirit in Tinker. Actually, it doesn't look like spirit because it's not yellow. Also, my outfit, it, it's a little crazy right now, but that's because it was the new year. I'm still celebrating the new year. Okay, sorry about that. I love the dapples. I think the dapples are beautiful. This horse, it's like greenish blue tinted. I do love the detail though. Like look at all this detail. It's just greenish blue. Like it's a, I didn't realize that before. It's like a sea green, you know, bluish tinted tail. But if you look at this one, it, it's more neutral colored. I don't know. I mean, in general, it is super cute. I'm just not into it. You know, I've been thinking of changing this horse's mane to braids because I saw someone in braids. This horse just looks so beautiful, even though the braids, they kind of look like little turds, but it's okay. Oh God, I just, oh God. Violet pops out of nowhere. Yeah, I came out of the mane changing thing. Hey, this is the one that I didn't buy last time. Maybe it's because it's right next to the Palomino, but it looks darker to me today. Maybe it's just because the Palomino is so light that right when you look at the Palomino next to the chestnut, it makes the chestnut actually look darker. That's my theory. I think this one looks like angel cake, like angel food cake, but I don't know if I want to get this horse. If I did get this horse, I would name this horse Angel Cake because, you know, from Strawberry Shortcake, I think there's actually, yeah, there's a character named Angel and she looks just like this. I love the ear marking. That's really cool. The only thing I'm a little iffy about is the fact that the mane and stuff, it's not super, super shaded. It's so, so white. Imagine getting your horse this clean in real life. Okay, in real life, I used to have a Palomino, and even when I would give the horse a bath, he would not look this white. I wish this one would have this mane. Someone's like, I'm glad they didn't mirror them. Me too. I really love the eyes. What the heck? The eyes are so beautiful. I just don't know if I want to actually buy this horse. Wait, I completely missed this one. Oh my gosh, I missed the dark bay. The dark bay? was my second favorite out of all of them. So let's see how this one looks. Oh my gosh. Okay, this one looks like a turtle. So you know, tur no, not, <laughs> not turtle as in the animal, turtle as in the chocolate. The chocolate with the pecans and the caramel. That's what this horse looks like. So if I got this horse, I would name this horse. Would I name this horse turtle? So I can name this horse turtle something as the Yorvik name and then I can do Franklin because Franklin's the name of a turtle even though I just said I'm not naming this one after an animal turtle. So this is the, this one almost looks mirrored but it's not, don't worry. Whoever this is, she's on to something. 
<laughs> okay, sorry. The muzzle, it's very purple. I don't know what happened. See, this one did not dip her nose in purple paint, but this one did. The black and white one did. Where's the black and white one? I didn't notice on the black and white one until after I got it. The North Swedishes, they just have the cutest horse face in the entire game. They just look so, not necessarily realistic, but they are the cutest ones, you know? Honestly, in this lighting, this doesn't look that great. It looks like bacon, kind of purple bacon. That's what it looks like. You know what I wish? I wish the Connemaras had the new braids. If the Connemaras had the new braids, then they would probably be my ultimate favorite breed. Just because they're such a good size and they have the nicest jump out of all horses. Should I actually buy the horse now? Oh my gosh. I was stalling. Oh no, oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding. Turtle's not a second name. Is Turtle a first name? Is Turtle even a name? Dude, what if Turtle's not a name? I don't know why I thought that turtle was a name. I could do chocolate caramel because that's a turtle. And then this horse's nickname could be turtle or it could be Franklin. I see a walrus. How can walrus be a name option and not turtle? I wish I could just ask this horse, what do you want your name to be? What would you like to be called instead of me having to choose, okay? Like, what do you want? Do you want Franklin or Turtle? Because I like them both. This horse definitely looks like a Franklin to me. Yeah, we're gonna do Franklin, but because Franklin is a turtle, chocolate caramel makes sense because that's also a turtle. See, this all goes, okay? Congrats on your new horse. Thank you. I didn't even realize this. This one has heterochromia too. I didn't even notice that one eye wasn't blue. I'm not sure why they decided to make almost every single Tinker Horse have heterochromia just because from my understanding it's very uncommon. So I know this game isn't that realistic. It would be very rare, almost impossible for every Tinker to have heterochromia. You know that would actually be really cool. If I got the light dapple gray too because the black and white and the dark bay tobiano they kind of go together and then I'll have two dapples that go together bro where's my horse why can't I feel oh okay so am I dumb <laughs> that was a little ridiculous oh my gosh Okay, this horse kind of looks like an updated version of- hang on, I'll show you guys. Looks like an updated version of Tango. I think I almost sold Tango in my, you know, selling horses video. I don't know, I don't have the heart to get rid of him yet, even though he's kind of- I know I'll never ride him. Yeah, I think I'm gonna sell Tango, finally. Just because I feel like Franklin- is the new and improved version and i don't even use this horse at all and i'm never going to ride this horse yep we're getting rid of him i mean i think the only old body horse that i have now is carrots just because carrots is sentimental to me and i have not found a replacement for carrots technically apricot this one is the replacement for carrots but i don't even like the way that she looks very much she does not look like carrots whatsoever this horse is so beautiful but definitely purplish not as bad as you know other horses like the north swedish but it still is purple tinted at least it's not sea green and light blue tinted that's all i have to say see this horse is going to be buddies with panda Panda and Franklin. I mean, it would be funny if it was Turtle and Panda because they're both animals, but I think this horse looks more like a Franklin. I feel like I would name a horse Turtle that actually has dapples because that's more of a turtle pattern, you know? 
They're very similar, but they're very different at the same time. Oh, I've been keeping my horses pretty happy, so every other day, or like once every three days really, I've been doing stable care. Even though, look at all of this, I have so many foods for my horses from the winter village. I used to never use stable care, and then now that I'm in dressage, I've started using stable care more. Should I make a new outfit? I haven't used any of these holiday sweaters yet. These are shiny, and these ones are very dull, so I think I want the shiny ones just because I like to be shiny. I just realized that my sweater is the only thing with brown on it. I was just about to run out. What am I supposed to be matching to this? Scratch the gray saddle pad situation. I think we're going to do brown. Sometimes this game makes me feel like I'm colorblind. Now we have brown and brown, gray and gray, black and black. That might be too light. Dude, I think this might be too light. Oh well. So here's what happened. I saw Nova Miss Grove's video and I saw her earning Eurovic shillings from doing archaeology in Epona, right? So I decided to do the exact same thing. I did not realize how easy it was to get a bunch of shillings and buy stuff. I've gotten all of the prizes except for this blue jacket that I still cannot get from Dino Valley. It is a little bit frustrating, but I'm not going to give up. You only do the extra interesting finds. Oh my gosh, yes. And then you turn them in and you get a lot of Jorvik shillings. I finished all of the token things and I didn't even want to finish the last part of the token collection because, you know, it's in Pandoria and it's very difficult. Um, we found out and we got lost in Pandoria and it was a great experience. If some of you can't level up, there's 500 XP that you get from the token stuff. And I didn't even know that. Someone in the club told me, don't you know you get 500 XP? And I, like, my jaw dropped. I'm g so greedy for XP. <gasps> Another extra interesting find. See, this is a lucky day for me. Usually it takes me a lot longer to find extra interesting finds. I can't move the screen down anymore and his teeth are sticking out. He looks like a little dork. Now that I'm done dino hunting dino hunting did i just say dino hunting i will show you the magic and the wonder that archaeology actually holds you know why are the windows like that is it what the heck is going on okay some buildings need an update so we trade in some stuff did i get a book page okay so here's what we got we got some chanclas what it says a copper bracelet and you sell it. Then you have your big shillings. And I'm selling that too because it, I don't like it. What was I even going to buy? See, I get carried away and I completely forgot what I was going to buy. I think I am actually going to get this just because I feel like it would go with a lot of stuff. So then, now I have no shillings. But it's okay because I have this saddle pad. This matches super well. Yeah, either saddle pad works really well. Oh my gosh, I know what I need to do. I need to go to the main, the horse main and tail stylist because I would like to see how this horse looks in braids. You know, I really love the mane as it is just because it's very, it's very floofy, but I'm going to see if I would like to change it. Oh my, very handsome. I like that you can see the nice blaze better that's really my favorite part about doing braids is that you can actually see the entire marking on a horse or some markings are even hidden so i don't know i think i would miss a little caramel swirl i think i would definitely miss it let's hang out with this npc a lot of people have been saying that these frisian sport horses need to be updated or technically frisians in general and i would agree i hope you guys enjoyed this video Thanks for watching. Bye. Okay, the NPC just impaled me. It's it's all good.